Every year, gamers are treated to good games and some not so good games. But once in a while, a game is released that is both a joy to play and a real work of art. Shadow of the Colossus is that kind of game. Shadow of the Colossus is a third-person action-adventure game published by Sony Computer Entertainment and developed by Team Ico. Released in 2005 for the PlayStation 2 and released again in 2011 for the PlayStation 3. Considered to be the spiritual successor to Team Ico's previous game, Ico, Shadow of the Colossus is the kind of game that will not only suck you in for hours on end, but also leaves a lasting impression. You play as a young man who has traveled far from his home to the Forbidden Land in order to restore the life of a young maiden. Once there, you meet an entity known as Dorman, who promises to try and restore the girl, but only after you've destroyed 16 colossi that roam the land. Armed with nothing but your sword and bow, and aided by your trustworthy horse, your quest begins to defeat these massive colossi. And that's all the story you get in Shadow of the Colossus. But in all honesty, that's all the story you need. Most of the game's backstory is shrouded in mystery, and little more is given throughout the entirety of the game. It's just you against 16 massive colossi. Each colossus's design is unique, as is the way needed to defeat them. The puzzles in the game aren't roadblocks needing a hidden switch combination to get past, but are instead the colossi themselves. Simply climbing up and stabbing the weak point may work on the first colossus, but you'll find it won't be so easy from then on. It's your wits against their size and strength. You'll have to watch the actions of your giant foes and use your environment and anything else at your disposal to find the best way to defeat them. It's not always easy, but when you do solve the secret to defeating the Colossus, you feel even more empowered and clever when you slay them. Shadow of the Colossus is also one of the best looking games on the PlayStation 2, ahead of its time and pushing the console's graphics capabilities to its limits. The open world of the Forbidden Lands is a variety of deserts, forests, swamps, grasslands, mountains, temple ruins, and lakes that are ripe for exploration. And you'll be checking out each and every area as you hunt down the imposing colossi. The colossi themselves also look stunning. Each one is a combination of fur, stone, dirt, and grass, and while some even have architectural-like structures jutting out from their bodies. But what's a great looking game without an amazing soundtrack to go with it? Shadow of Colossus succeeds in this too, with music that matches the intensity and beauty of the world you're in. And when I'm fighting a 12-story monster, this is the kind of music I want playing. For all its greatness, however, Shadow of the Colossus may not be for everyone. Some players may not enjoy that the entire game consists of only 16 boss fights and nothing else. And if the look of the open world doesn't capture your interest, then you might find it a little boring riding your horse through an empty landscape just to get to the next boss fight. But then again, the sense of emptiness and loneliness is sort of one of the main points of the game. The game also has very sensitive controls, and your horse will often veer off in a direction you didn't intend just because you nudged the joystick to the left on accident. And if you're not great at puzzle solving, figuring out the key to defeating a colossi can be a bit frustrating. Team Ico's Shadow of the Colossus is an experience that every gamer should at least try. You'll never find another game like it anywhere, and it's one you'll never forget. It doesn't need the complicated or flashy combos and over-the-top explosions that other action-adventure RPGs have these days. It succeeds in its simplicity. Each battle against a Colossus is unique and memorable. The game ranges from calm and relaxing as you ride through beautiful landscapes, to intense and heart-pounding as you try to avoid being smashed to pieces by a Colossus. And if nothing else, Shadow of the Colossus is a game that you will always remember.